Oh, I got a major, well, I got a major win, a major W this week. I used the power of girl failure to become a girl boss. <laughs> How, you ask? Allow me to educate you. So I got my new lease agreement and they raised well, my rent $500 which they can do because there is no cap where I live. So they can just do that. And the thing is, is I am working two jobs now. So I can technically afford it, but also I don't want to do that. Uh, so I brought out my girl failure and I was literally like, listen, I'm a one income household. I've never missed a rent payment. I'm gonna have to move out. If it's this expensive, I can't pay this. I'm so stressed. Can you please make it lower? And they lowered it by half. <laughs> What's funny is if I had gotten the lease agreement and it had been a $250 raise in my rent, I would have been pissed about that too. You know what I mean? I would have been like, what the heck? This is dumb. But considering that it was going to be 500 and I got it lowered, now I'm like, whew, it's only two big. Maybe that was their plan from the beginning. I don't know. They probably already had 250. I'll tell you what I actually think happened is so where I am living currently was all new builds. They're like duplex. Yeah, it's also a duplex, just so you guys know. It was like all brand new builds. So it's like a little tiny little neighborhood of duplexes, but they're new builds. And so everybody moved in at pretty much the same time. Uh, and I've not been here for like super long, but because of that, all of our leases are basically at the same time. So we all moved in at the same time and not many people have moved out. So pretty much everybody who's here is like who moved in the same week that I moved in. <laughs> well, what's interesting is I actually waited a little bit when I got my lease agreement. I didn't know what to do. So I just let it like sit for like two weeks, three weeks. Actually, I think I let it slip for, I think, I, I think it sat for like a whole month before I did anything. Cause I was like, I don't know what to do. That's so much money. I'm definitely not signing it. And in that time period, there has been a lot of moving trucks. There's been a lot of, there's like a mass move out going on right now. Where like everybody in my little neighborhood is moving out. So actually what I think happened is that they realized people didn't want to pay that much more and they are leaving. Greedy business practices shooting yourself in the foot, yeah. Anyways, this has inspired me to decide it is finally time to buy a house. Which to be honest has always felt really, really impossible to me. Like it just didn't seem like I could ever make enough money <laughs> to afford a down payment. Um, but now I can. All this time, all I had to do was work two jobs. <laughs> That's all I had to do this entire time. Was work two jobs. That's crazy. <laughs> Fine then. Goodbye. Goodbye then. Goodbye. F goodbye forever. <laughs>